All right, Steve, after that much needed rain last night, that didn't last long today. It was very hot outside today. Yeah, and tomorrow's going to be even hotter. So if you can find a beach, a pool, that will uh, really satisfy you in terms of getting some heat relief. Otherwise, you're going to have to find a way inside into some AC or drink plenty of water here. We're going to be in the low 90s and more humidity tomorrow, too. So let's break it down for you as we look live from the Maryland Science Center camera. As you can see, some haze in the air, nothing like what we we were dealing with though uh, about Wednesday or Thursday of last week. As you can see, weather headlines, a nice evening to be outside. Tomorrow it's a hot one. Temperatures back into the low 90s. If that happens, that'll be the second day this season we've been in the 90s. And as we move toward Monday, this is a big headline. We need these showers and storms. Unfortunately, I don't see us getting anything more than a, a less than an inch of rain here. So it's going to be at least some rain, but not a drought buster. And then Tuesday and Wednesday, some more spectacular weather moving our way. Here's your forecast for the next four days 91. So the heat peaks certainly tomorrow. More humidity as well. Monday, you're feeling that humidity all day long. We'll get some random downpours, I think, especially in the afternoon and evening hours as a few clusters of storms move through the area. And then we get a nice refreshing air mass in here by Tuesday and Wednesday. Another chance of showers coming in here on Thursday. So we buy ourselves another dry day. It happens to be a weekend day, so that's good for your Sunday. We'll get ourselves some much needed rainfall from this storm system that's organizing tonight in the state of Texas. So here's your forecast for this evening. Comfortably cool temperatures dropping down into the 60s, mid 60s inside the beltway. I think low 60s outside of the beltway with a mostly clear to partly cloudy sky. Here's the forecast for tomorrow. Yes, there's going to be some air quality issues, but for a different reason. It won't be smoke in the air. You won't be smelling it, but it's from ground level ozone. You get that on certainly the hotter days of the year tomorrow. No exception. So here's your planner for the day. Sunshine temperatures get up into the mid 80s by lunchtime already. It's a hot afternoon, low 90s. Heat index tomorrow, probably about 93 uh, with the humidity in the air. There will be a gusty breeze, so at least the wind will be moving tomorrow afternoon. That breeze applies to the beach locations as well, where the onshore wind will help cool you off down into the 80s. Chance of a shower or thunderstorm early Monday, but also Monday afternoon. I think that's your better shot for showers and storms as this storm system passes on through. Right now, it looks like generally between a quarter and three quarters of an inch of rain out of this storm system on Monday, Monday evening. 82 on Tuesday, 84 on Wednesday, Thursday, another late day shower possible. And then next weekend, of course, it's all about AFRAM. Right now, Saturday looks like a good start here to the weekend, at least with temperatures in the middle 80s. We'll be right back.